Hey everyone, it's Paige Sporanic, and we are back for another tip. So I get this question a lot from people. How do I fix that dreaded over the top slicey shot swing that I do? And I've actually been struggling with this a lot too. And one thing that's been very difficult is when people say, well just come from underneath it. What does that mean and how do I do it? And how do I fix it? I think it's very difficult in the golf swing to to actually make a change because a change this small can feel this big and you don't even know if you're doing it or not because we're so ingrained to do the same thing over and over and over again. So making that change, it's kind of scary, but you have to really exaggerate it. So this is a drill that I do every day to make sure that I'm not coming over the top. When I talk about over the top, it's when you are, it's, if this is on plane, you're coming over it this way and then the other way is underneath that way. And so if you're coming over it, the only thing you can do, instead of it having it go straight left, is you open the face to save it and that's where you get that, that slice shot where it kind of starts left of your target and just moves right and doesn't stop moving right. And so you probably notice I have a head cover down and you're like, what's that for? Well, this is to help me feel coming underneath it. I am a very feel player. Um, I have to sense something, I have to see something, I have to, um, you can't just tell me to do it and I'll do it. I can't do that. So this is a great drill for me. So if I do my over the top swing, I'm just hitting that head cover and it's going flying. And so you'll know right away, I'm not gonna go get that. <laughs> so you'll know right away that you came over the top because you obviously hit the head cover. So you can feel it, you can sense it, you're getting that reaction right away. And so you put it, you put it, you want to put it close because you want to train your body to do something different, something exaggerated. And this not, might not be the swing that you want to do, but this is, this is a swing that's going to help you get to the swing you want. And that's by exaggerating it, feeling something that's different. So I want to feel like I'm going to hit this huge kind of underneath, almost like a draw kind of hook swing just so I can feel something a little bit different. So as you can tell, I didn't hit the head cover. It felt different. You will also tell the difference on where you hit it. So usually if you're coming over the top, your shots are gonna be on the toe. And if you start to come a little too underneath it, they tend to be a little bit more on the heel. So there's a lot of other things that could possibly happen when it comes to why you go over the top or why you go underneath it. But this drill really helps me kind of even everything out. Um, it's really easy to do, it's easy to feel, it's easy to see, you know, right away if you're doing it wrong or right. And it's uh, that one drill I really always count on when things just aren't going right for me. So all you have to do is put a stick down to line up where you're going and then put a head cover down pretty close to your ball and almost at an angle that you want to swing at. So I put it like this because I want to swing more around this way and if I wanted to come, if you have the problem of coming underneath it, you want to come over the top, then you move it that way so your swing path will move that way. So it's a great drill to do. Um, it's something that I really love and I hope you enjoy this tip today and I will see you next time.